I know you're out there. We get high on finding the inexpensive designer deals, don't we? That is why TJ Maxx is one of our very favorite stores of all time. I freaking love the place. Hundreds and hundreds of you have told me how much you also love TJ Maxx, but I've had a lot of questions about what my favorite brands are there. Like when you go to TJ Maxx, there's a lot of fluff. And by fluff, I mean there's a lot of things that either have been manufactured for a discount store or just isn't high quality. I am always feeling for fabrics, for detail, for design, and for all those luxurious, beautiful things that really make us feel good when we put them on with a discount. And so today, it's you and me, babe. I am gonna show you my very favorite brands that I say yes to at TJ Maxx. At the same time, you probably have your favorites as well. So make sure you comment below on some of your favorite brands so we can all kind of partake on um, some things maybe we haven't tried. Now I've talked about Kyoden before. Kyoden is a athletic brand that has some very interesting similarities to Lululemon. Way back in the day, us Kyoden girls, we would have Facebook groups around finding absolute dupes for what was coming out in the day when Lululemon was just starting to ramp up in popularity. There's been a lot talked about, but I will tell you, Kyoden has really stood the test of time. They've gone through their slumps the last couple of years, and um, I will say I still have my eye on them. So if you're shopping in the athletic section, I want you to start by looking in the leggings for Kyoden. You'll notice a couple things. Number one, the quality of the material is really good. It's very soft. It's not sort of scratchy like some of the other brands sold at TJ Maxx. And the design details are really good too. You know, they come out with sort of the look-alike Rulu that Lululemon has. They do the ruffles and they've even gone so far as to come out with jackets that are exact replicas of what we've seen from more expensive brands. Hey, hey I'm in a post edit right now. And this is crazy. Did you know that TJ Maxx has updated their website so that you can now search by brand? Do you all see this? Do you see this right here? I just put in Kyoden. It just pulled up 28 results. You guys, this is huge. This is a Maxinista thing. This is really exciting because now, when I send you to TJ Maxx, you can search for Kyoden and see everything that they have. You can also search for everything else I'm gonna tell you about in a few minutes. The second brand that I'm super excited about and I have seen more and more and more at TJ Maxx the last year is Good American. Now I haven't done too much talking about Good American, but you guys, I'm slightly obsessed. Here's what I love about Good American. This brand knows how to fit a woman. And when I say woman, I mean woman of all shapes and sizes. It's incredible. They go from a double zero all the way up, I think almost past an 18. So no matter what your size is, I really want you to try this brand. Good American's coming out with athletic wear. And if you are not familiar, it's sold on Nordstrom as well as the Good American site and now it is sold on tjmax.com. So I have a couple sports bras that gulp, I don't even wanna tell you how much I've spent on them because I've been so excited about the design. Just doing a quick browse on the tjmax.com athletic wear page, there's a ton of Good American. Now looking for Good American at TJ Maxx, number one, I would suggest go right to the athletic wear section. Since we're seeing it online, I think you should go to the athletic wear section to start looking for it. Number two, definitely contemporary. Go right into contemporary and you will start to see most denim. So that's the other part of Good American that I love. You are in the business of looking for a new pair of denim, try Good American. I don't think you'll be disappointed. They're high rise, they're super stretchy, they keep their shape. I'm in love. Number three, Italian linen. Spring and summer is a super big time to see Italian linen come out. And so if you are a, a linen lover in the summer, like I am, you could go somewhere like Etsy or some of these smaller boutiques and find very, very expensive linen dresses. Well, I have been in store and have seen the most gorgeous, beautiful, high quality linen dresses. 
so um, as you can see online I have pulled up a range of linen that they're already releasing and we're not even fully into spring yet so do a quick search online for linen and see what you find if you would like a beautiful linen dress for the summer this is the place to get it look at these prices it's absolutely phenomenal so Italian linen also make sure you look in your store go to the dress department and go through the racks if you go through the racks you'll be able to see and hopefully identify pieces that are just going to get you through the entire warm weather season okay next up let's go to bags speaking of italy Clearly I'm in love with anything Italian. Again, I'm gonna list a bunch of brands, but all Italian leather. Now in store, the Italian leather bags normally will have a tag that says made in Italy. Also online, you'll see um, that they have an exclusive page dedicated to Italian leather. Beautiful. So I'm talking Valentina, Gianni, Chiarina, Divini Ferenz, Velour. I mean, the list goes on. These brands are gorgeous. Soft, supple, buttery leather. That's what we're talking about. Soft, supple, buttery leather. These are the bags you want to look for. So as you're scanning through all the bags in store, I want you to try to spot or eye the made in Italy bags. Otherwise online, it's a pretty fast search. You can see what's available. Go online regularly because these bags will sell out and the pricing is amazing. Amazing if you find the right bag that you absolutely love. Okay, my next brand, Sand and Fog Candles. Now, you've heard me say this before. This is in the home department. These Sand and Fog Candles consistently smell like the Anthropology ones. So if you are used to spending a ton of money at Anthropology, these Sand and Fog Candles at a quarter of the price smell exactly like them. So California Citrus, smells exactly like the volcano capri blue i'm telling you you've got to try it i've experimented across the board with all of the sand and fog candles and love almost every one of them now again this is personal preference but the next time you're in the home department just do me a favor and try it out and you'll see what i mean sand and fog yum okay next free people. So you're always seeing free people at TJ Maxx and you might be wondering like is it worth it? Free people does an amazing job with like couture meets boho meets everyday and I love their stuff. For the most part there's a lot of things I say no to with free people but I will tell you there are a lot of things I've wanted to say yes to but they were just so expensive like fur coats, really good utility jackets, fabulous joggers, even all of their athletic wear. I'm seeing all of it at TJ Maxx right now. So this is an area in the contemporary section I would not skip. Always go to that free people. See if you can get yourself a good pair of denim or beautiful blouse. Like I always say though, just make sure you love it. Okay, another brand that I love TJ Maxx is selling, Lafayette 148. It's expensive. The draping of Lafayette 148 is what gets me. And that plus quality is everything. So Lafayette 148, I'm seeing it. I'm seeing it at TJ Maxx right now, online and in store. Pause, take a moment. At the very least, try it on and see how it makes you feel and then watch it go on sale if it's still too expensive in your store. Lafayette 148 is a winner. Now, for some of you, you may be thinking, Melissa, I don't get these expensive brands in my store. That's okay. We have talked about this before. There are uh, runway TJ Maxx stores and there are non-runway TJ Maxx stores, but the runway is always on online. So make sure you're checking online regularly I think the real deal hunters are always online um, and if you come across a piece that you think will flatter you and you really like you got to check it out Okay, the next brand, Rag & Bone. Rag & Bone is one of, I think, my favorite brands. A lot of their blazers or their coats are just tailored in a way that really hits the spot for me. Uh, there have been moments at my TJ Maxx stores where there's a ton of Rag & Bone and I get super excited because uh, I can try on different sizes and different styles and there's times where it's not. But I'm seeing it also a lot online. So pay attention to Rag & Bone. Also, Rag 
Dragon Bone denim is really good, like really good, maybe even better than good American from a quality standpoint. So if you come across a pair of Dragon Bone denim that you haven't tried yet, try them. The rise is really nice, the quality is beautiful, especially if you can find a pair that fit and flatter. Oh my God, so good. Okay, shoes. I am gonna make an entire shoe video because no woman should go to work feeling uncomfortable in her heels. Like, all heels are not created equal, and I am on the hunt to find the most amazing shoes that are comfortable for us working women. But for now, I wanted to just share one of my favorite brands at TJ Maxx. Besides finding an amazing designer deal, like a Tory Burch or something, I think it is worth keeping your eye on Dolce Vita. And if you notice, most of the brands that are mainstream, like a Target, for example, will do a ton of duping of Dolce Vita. The the design is everything. Are they an Italian designer? Why don't we just all move to Italy? That's what I have to say. So um, if you can get the real thing affordably, why not? You find it at TJ Maxx, you know you're gonna get a discount. Okay, so coming up next, what I say no to at TJ Maxx. This is huge. No is sometimes more important than the yes. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed. Comment below, what are your favorite brands at TJ Maxx? How are you finding deals? I gotta run to a meeting. Cheers, my friends, to happy shopping all day long at TJ Maxx. I love you. Mwah.